Recently, I was put in a position where I had to rebarrel an eight millimeter Shoshaw, and I ran into an issue with the newer style CIP reamer drawing. Pacific Tool and Gauge made me a beautiful 100% copy of an 8x51 rim labelle from the, C from the SIP drawing, and I ran into an issue where any ammunition I attempted to feed that chamber didn't fit, it didn't go all the way in. And yet, this ammunition fit previously chambered Shoshas, it fit previously chambered um, um, Berthiers, and it went in, uh, all this ammunition went in there, ammunition that was reloaded. My, uh, my chamber gauges here were reloaded in my shop on two different kinds of uh, reloading dies. They didn't fit either. So I started wondering, we did a little bit of miking, and what we had noticed was that the chamber, the, uh, the CIP chamber diagram at diameter P0 located at length P0 was too small for all commercially manufactured ammunition that I could find except for one lot of PPU 8 millimeter label that will go in it. It does go all the way in. We found that odd. So after a short discussion with the individuals at Pacific Tool Engage, and by short I mean like two hours, we went through some things here to look, and we found that there were eight different uh, eight millimeter label chambers that were called out, and that the one that appeared to work with original ammunition that we had, that we had with reloads, that we had with modern uh, ammunition that would fit in the new barrel, bang. We had that drawing made, and that was print number 18337. We have fired several rounds of ammunition through this particular chamber, and then reloaded it on a Redding 8 millimeter label reloading die. It goes right in. I'm saying that the one diameter on the CIP drawing, diameter P0 at length L0, is a little tight. It's a bit tight. It, 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 the call out for it, one 3.06 millimeters, when in fact I know it needs to be about one 3.2 millimeters. That's pretty much where we're at. We had this, this particular drawing you're looking at here is called out in inches. However, if you work that right, um, the, the, what, what was happening was is it was tight right here on the belt. Anyway, I just thought you should know that there is a difference in the two reamers. I don't know what's going on over in Europe with ammunition supply. But I know that if you're going to chamber something that will run ammunition that most people want to make over here in the States, you might want to beware of which one of the two 8mm uh, LaBelle Ramers that you uh, purchased. Thank you for your time. I, I hope this helps somebody.